Yes, Your Honor. Good afternoon, Your Honor. This is the case number IT0481I. The prosecutor of the tribunal against Momisilo Perisic. And the appearances for the prosecutor. Good afternoon, Your Honor. Representing the Office of the Prosecutor, I am Dermot Groom, accompanied by Kareem Aga Khan and Chester Stamp, and assisted by Sky Winner. Thank you, Mr. Groom. And for the accused? Uh, Your Honor, you'll have to make deal, I'm afraid, with simple Kareem Khan uh, for uh, the, uh, the accused uh, as duty counsel. So, happy to have you, Mr. Khan. Well, this, as you know, is the initial appearance of Mr. Monchilo Perisic. The hearing will be conducted in accordance with the provisions of Rule 62. And at the hearing, the accused will be asked to enter a plea on the indictment in the case against him. Please stand, Mr. Perisic. <coughs> Uh, let me first ascertain whether you can hear the proceedings in a language that you understand. Yes. Thank you. Uh, Mr. Khan, um, I, I take it that Mr. Perisic has received a copy of the indictment and that you have had the opportunity of going through the indictment with, with him and informing him of the nature of the charges against him. Uh, Your Honour, I have. Uh, he's read the indictment uh, and he understands the nature of the charges that he faces. And as you're aware, um, the accused has a right to have the indictment read out in court before he pleads to it. He may also waive the right. Uh, what does he wish to do? Uh, Your Honour, the accused is mindful of the uh, preciousness of court time uh, and he's happy uh, to uh, waive his rights uh, as far as having the full indictment read out to him today. Thank you. I'm grateful for the cooperation. Uh, Mr. Perisic, um, you've heard what your counsel has said. You've had the indictment in a language you understand. He has been through it with you, informed you of the nature of the charges against you. Now, you may enter a plea today or within 30 days of this appearance. Uh, do you wish to enter a plea today? Your Honor, I wish to enter a plea today. Well, the, in the counts in the indictment will be read out to you by the court deputy. She will read the counts and I will take your plea. Please commence. Count one, murder, a crime against humanity, punishable under Article 5A and 7-1 and, and 7-3 of the Statute of the Tribunal. And how do you plead, Mr. Perisic, guilty or not guilty? Your Honor, not guilty. Thank you. Count two. Count two, murder, a violation of the laws or customs of war as recognized by Common Article 31A of the Geneva Convention of 1949, punishable under Article 3 and 7-1 and, and 7-3 of the Statute of the Tribunal. How do you plead, Mr. Perisic, guilty or not guilty? Your Honor, not guilty. Count three. Count, count three. Inhumane Act, a crime against humanity, punishable under Article 5I, and 7 1 and 7 3 of the statute of the tribunal. How do you plead guilty or not guilty? Your Honor, not guilty. Count four. Count four. A tax on civilians, a violation of the laws or customs of war, as recognized by Article 51 2 of Additional Protocol 1 and Article 13 2 of Additional Protocol 2 to the Geneva Conventions of 1949, punishable under Article 3 and 7 1 and 7 3 of the Statute of the Tribunal. How do you plead, guilty or not guilty? Your Honor, not guilty. 
5. Count 5. Murder. A crime against humanity. Punishable under Article 5A and 73 of the Statute of the Tribunal. How do you plead? Guilty or not guilty? Your Honor, not guilty. Thank you. Count 6. Murder. A violation of the laws or customs of war as recognized by Common Article 31A of the Geneva Conventions of 1949, punishable under Article 3 and 73 of the Statute of the Tribunal. Or do you plead guilty or not guilty? Yes, Not guilty. Thank you. Count 7. Inhuman acts. A crime against humanity, punishable under Article 5I and 73 of the Statute of the Tribunal. How do you plead, guilty or not guilty? Your Honor, not guilty. It attacks on civilians a violation of the laws and customs of war as recognized by Article 51.2 of the Additional Protocol I and Article 13.2 of the Additional Protocol II to the Geneva Conventions of 1949, punishable under Article 3 and 7.3 of the Statute of the Tribunal. How do you plead? Guilty or not guilty? Your Honor, not guilty. Count 9. Count 9, murder, a crime against humanity, punishable under Article 5 a and 7.1 and 7.3 of the Statute of the Tribunal. How do you plead guilty or not guilty? Your Honor, not guilty. Ten. Count 10, murder, a violation of the laws or customs of war as recognized by Comma Article 31A of the Geneva Conventions of 1949, punishable under Article 3 and 7.1 and 7.3 of the Statute of the Tribunal. <coughs> How do you plead, guilty or not guilty? Your Honor, not guilty. Seven. Inhuman acts, a crime against humanity, punishable under Article 5I and 7.1 and 7.3 of the Statute of the Tribunal. How do you plead, guilty or not guilty? <coughs> Your Honor, not guilty. Count 12. Count 12. Persecutions on political, <coughs> racial, and religious grounds, a crime against humanity, including murder, cruel and humane treatment, and forcible transfer, punishable under Article 5H and 7.1 and 7.3 of the Statute of the Tribunal. How do you plead? Guilty or not guilty? Your Honor, not guilty. Count 13. Count 13, extermination, a crime against humanity, punishable under Article 5B and 7.1 and 7.3 of the Statute of the Tribunal. How do you plead? Your Honor, not guilty. Thank you. You may sit. It, it only remains for me, Mr. Groom, to remind you of your obligation under Rule 66 to make available to the defense uh, within 30 days uh, copies of the supporting material which accompanied the indictment. Your Honor, I recognize our obligations in that regard and, it, and our intention is to fully comply with them. Thank you, Mr. Groom. Is there any other matter? Not from the prosecution, Your Honor. Mr. Khan? No. Uh, Your Honour, there's no matter that need uh, trouble you to any great extent, but as a matter of information, um, the accused does have a, a lawyer of his own, uh, Mr. Batic Vladan. Um, it's uh, hoped by the accused that Olad would uh, deal with his application to be admitted onto the Rule 45 list with its customary uh, expedition. Your Honour, that's particularly important uh, in this case uh, because. Uh, the uh, accused voluntarily surrendered to the jurisdiction of the tribunal and it's very much in his interests, particularly given his age, um, that uh, a provisional release application is submitted by the lawyer of his own choice within the parameters of the registrar's obligations uh, at the earliest opportunity. Your Honour, that's just for your information at the moment. Thank you very much. I expect the registrar will discharge his duties. There being no other matter, the hearing is adjourned. All right, we're here for the fair.